Hello, good morning. It's Monday the 2nd. I'm FX Plu and this is the Market Brief. So it's a new month and we've got a new lockdown. Remember, remember, the 5th of November. It's when we stay home to save lives. Pithy, hey? Um, standard lockdown procedures will apply. So shops, pubs and gyms, pretty much all the good stuff will close. Schools and universities will remain open this time around despite some infection spikes being attributed to those nasty, nasty freshers. Uh, the good news is the original furlough scheme will now be extended. Uh, that has already cost an estimated £40 billion, and so it'll probably give Sunak the odd sleepless night as he's still working on his spending plan, which is due out in about three weeks. Um, meanwhile, it sounds like Brexit hasn't really progressed. Ursula von der Leyen said that fishing rights and state subsidies remain the two issues holding up any deal there. Um, and Sterling lost a bit of ground last week with the rumours of Covid uh, infection leading to a new lockdown. Uh, we traded down to about 128.80 against the dollar, uh, but we kick off the new month around 129.10 and we're just shy of the 111 mark against the euro. Uh, markets may get a little twitchy with the uncertainty around the US election, that's obviously due tomorrow. Uh, Biden is still ahead in the polls but his supporters remain a little jittery given the lead that Hillary Clinton lost uh, four years ago. Volatility could also come from the fear that Trump will challenge the result if he's narrowly defeated. Um, but away from the campaign trail, uh, weekly jobless data continues to fall. Um, we had initial claims just over the 750,000 mark and continuing claims were down to 7.75 million last week. This week we've got a Fed meeting and we'll also have uh, the non-farm sweepstake on Friday, but both are likely to be overshadowed by this little election. Uh, the euro lost a little ground last week after the ECB hinted at further support coming in December, um, and that added to fears of a double dip recession looming on the continent. Euro dollar fell to a low of 116.40, and we open a little lower still this morning, around 116.30 on the open. Uh, right, that's it from me today. Have a wonderful day. Hope it's shaping up to be a good week. Um, and for those planning to watch the election, rest up. It's a late night tomorrow, that's for sure. Join me again in the morning. All the best. If you do not have a clue, then just tweet through and ask FX Blue.